So hello and welcome to today's mod showcase video, and it's a real recreation of the Beta Boys Dawn mod made by Cautious. Now as we turn the camera around, we can see exactly what this mod has in store for us. Because Cautious has gone to the effort to fully replace the Boys Dawn with a Beta one, because this isn't like the Beta Boys Dawn mod from, um, I believe it was Tails Fusion, who sort of remade the Boys Dawn from the Girls Dawn, if that makes any sense. You know, the one I showcased on my channel in um, 2018. But yeah, if we take a look at the exterior, we can see it's pretty much, there's no obvious deformities or anything like that. And I just want to show this thing around the side as well. He's even gone to the effort to restore the removed um, bathroom entrance. To enter, all we have to do is just jump in there. But I'll showcase that off when we're actually inside the building. So let's take a look inside. Now, as we enter, we can see that nothing has changed. Now, don't worry, I've not misled you or anything like that. It's because the Beta Boys Dorm has its entrance right at the side. So as we make our way down the hall, we can now see that a doorway has appeared where the graffiti tag used to be. And we can now see our second floor entrance. And the tag that was here has been moved back a fair bit. And as we go up, we can see it has perfect collision. And some of you might remember this kind of area from the, well, this particular Beta screenshot of Bully. So let's give these rules a quick read. Not allowed to curse, not allowed to smoke, not allowed to fight, not allowed to something, something, also something. Can't read that one. Not allowed to tag and not allowed to bleed. Yeah, I can't really read that. Don't know if it's because it's low quality or not. But yeah, this is the Beta Boys Dorm second floor with perfect lighting. And here's the bathroom that was going to be, well, that we did see in another beta screenshot. If we sort of position Jimmy at this sink in particular, we can sort of get an idea of how like, this recreation looks compared to the, well, beta version of course. And if we go over here, this is the removed entrance. Well, next to these showers of course, which we can't actually get into. But we just jump through the window, and we're on the balcony. We can also get a good look at Bullworth Town from here, and we can just jump straight back in whenever we want. Now as we make our way down the hall, we can make our way to Jimmy's beta bedroom. Now this, I think, is the only part of the mod that is sort of an imagination rather than a beta recreation because as far as I'm aware there's been no sort of beta images of Jimmy's beta room or anything like that. And I keep saying beta a lot and I apologise. But yeah, this is sort of a recreation of that I guess. Or at least an imagination of it. Whichever one you think is best I guess. Now, one thing you may have noticed is that there doesn't seem to be any students spawning up here. And that's normal because this, I believe, is the first beta release. I keep saying that word and I apologise if it's getting annoying. But yeah, this is the first release and I don't know if he's going to add in more. But one small feature he added, which I think is quite good, is he actually added in an attic. Now, this I think is even more sort of earlier than the rest of the dorm because, well, we can't even get out of here. I'm not sure if this is just because it's borrowed from the girls dorm or anything like that, but yeah, I don't know if he's going to sort of make that another exit. So there's nothing to really do up here, but I think it's a really nice a bit of detail. Now one thing I really do love about this mod is it looks really authentic, and Cautious have put in so much effort to sort of give this dorm floor the kind of attention to detail that Rockstar did. Like if we enter these dorm rooms, we can see that they do look exactly the same as they do downstairs. The only difference is we can actually enter these ones because for some reason if we enter any of the dorm rooms from downstairs Jimmy just gets teleported straight back to his room. But yeah in my opinion this is professional quality. Like I think this looks like something Rockstar would, would have made if they stuck to the original beta second floor in that. So that's pretty much it for the mod showcase but I do have to say a few warnings about this because well, this is a very kind of finicky mod. Because if you're a regular viewer of mine, you probably know that I run pretty much God knows how many mods on Buddy. You know, like, people point out that the outfit that Jimmy would be wearing now would be reminiscent of the Horrid Henry one. But you may notice I'm not using them. And that is because this mod seems to absolutely hate world image mods. Like, when I downloaded this mod and installed it, it just crashed instantly. So I used an unmodded game, and it still crashed. Now, I don't know what the reasoning for this is, but I used the um, GIMG tool or something like that, that Cautious said to use, 
and it did work. So I tried installing it again on my modded world image and it still crashed again. So I thought, you know, maybe I'll try and install all my mods onto the beta dorm world image, if that makes any sense. I did that and it still crashed, even though all the mods I use, I know do not crash the game. So I installed them manually, one by one, you know, beta bullies pack, beta preppies pack. But as soon as I installed the beta greasers pack, it crashed instantly. So this mod does not like modded world images. So if you have mods on your game, do not use like this mod. Other than that though, if you are going to install it, please use backups because, well, let's be realistic here. If you have a load of mods like me, you don't want to lose them all because, you know, you didn't make a backup. So you're probably not going to see this mod again in any future videos, unless of course, like, cautious releases, an update or a fix or anything like that. So, yeah, that's about it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more buddy based content than that. Also, massive shout out goes to Cautious for making this mod, just gotta hope you know it makes it a bit more friendly with the world image mods. And that's it for today's video, and thank you for watching.